I'm Callie Lewis. You're watching Geek Brief TV. This is Brief 474. While we're not nearly as excited about TiVo adding Netflix HD streaming as TiVo adding pizza ordering a couple of weeks ago, it's still another tug at my heart to give up my Blockbuster subscription and switch to Netflix. The Netflix TiVo partnership started back in October, and now if you're subscribed to Netflix and have either a TiVo Series 3, TiVo HD, or TiVo HD XL, you can choose from a library of over 12,000 movies and TV episodes. The HD selection is modest to start, but it'll grow over time. I have a shiny new TiVo that's still in the box back there awaiting its permanent home, so it'll be a couple weeks before I'm able to try this out. If you give it a try, share your experience with the rest of us by leaving a comment in the show notes for Brief 474, please. While I was coughing up, well, you don't want to know. Last week, Logitech shipped their one billionth mouse. The number is pretty impressive when you step back and think how few electronics makers ship a billion of anything. Today, now that I'm feeling better, all Logitech announced is a lap desk for notebooks. It's shiny, white, and pretty. More importantly, it has a four-layer heat shielding design to protect your lap and parts in that vicinity. The bottom layer is fabric. It has an airflow chamber between the lap desk's base and top to minimize heat. The base is arched to to allow airflow around your legs. The top of the lap desk is a non-slip glossy hard surface angled at 12 degrees. Here's what I don't get. The lap desk at $40 could be a great Christmas gift, right? Wrong! It's not available until January and that's happening a lot. Black & Decker has a thermal leak detector that uses an infrared seeking sensor to help you discover heat leaks along walls, molding, and ductwork. You point it at a surface, move it around, and discover the spots in your home that could use insulation or caulk. Great potential stocking stuffer. I know guys that if they got this, would spend the greater part of Christmas afternoon playing with it. It's also $40 and it won't be out until spring of 2009. Apple Core released a new version of ATV Flash. For $50, they'll send you a USB key that will unlock an Apple TV and make it play whatever you want it to play. There are free ways to do it, but this is the simple, painless, least time-intensive way. You can find out more at ATVFlash.com. One thing I wonder about from time to time is why there isn't a strong kind of client-server system available for family computing. Why does every notebook and desktop in the house have to be a powerhouse? I think the explosive growth in the netbook market has proven that it doesn't. A company called Panologic Inc. is bringing to market a product that takes full advantage of server-based visualization. Their desktop client is 100% hardware. It has no CPU, no memory, no operating system, and no software. All the software lives on the server. The panel client is an attractive little cube that makes a Mac Mini look massive. On the back, it has five connections, VGA, Ethernet, USB, a mic in, and audio out. Unfortunately, Pano is only focused on the enterprise market, and at a price point of $300 per client in addition to a service contract, I think they're thinking small. Why not roll it out to the consumer market, too? That's it for today. This brief was brought to you by GoDaddy.com. When you purchase a domain name, hosting, or other services from GoDaddy.com, my promo codes GB1, GB2, and GB3 save you money and keep us fed. I'm Callie Lewis. Thanks for watching. All I ever wanted on my Christmas morning was you. All right. oh. <coughs> oh, baby, I'm sorry. This, the, don't, the apology was louder than the cough. I, I'm gonna whisper. I need different headphones for doing this. This is way too loud. Okay, here we go. Okay. I can't stop laughing. Hold on. I'm blowing out your eardrums.